Welcome back to BBC Earth Coins, where we uncover hidden treasures in the world of numismatics. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic, the 1980 Lincoln penny without a mint mark. Stay tuned to discover why this seemingly ordinary coin might be hiding a secret fortune. Before we delve into the value, let's talk about what makes this coin so special. The 1980 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is a rare find, as most coins from that year were minted in both Philadelphia and Denver, each marked with their respective P and D mint marks. However, a small number slipped through the cracks without any mint mark at all, and that's where the rarity lies. To understand the significance, let's travel back to 1980. This was a pivotal time in history, and little did we know that certain Lincoln pennies would become key players in the numismatic world. The absence of the mint mark wasn't intentional, making it an unintended treasure for collectors. Now, let's talk about the factors that contribute to the value of this coin. Like any collectible, condition is crucial. A well-preserved 1980 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is more likely to fetch a higher price. Rarity plays a significant role. The fewer in circulation, the greater the value. And of course, demand among collectors can drive up the price. So, how much could one of these elusive pennies be worth today? The market for the 1980 Lincoln penny without mint mark has seen a surge in interest, with some specimens fetching impressive prices at auctions and in private sales. The value can vary, but it's safe to say that these coins are worth more than their face value. To gain more insights, we reached out to numismatic experts who shed light on the growing popularity of this particular Lincoln penny. Their expertise and passion for coin collecting only underscore the allure of these rare gems. In January 2020, for this coin value in market $78,900. The 1980 Lincoln penny without a mint mark is a small but mighty coin that holds the potential for a substantial return on investment. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, keep an eye out for this hidden treasure during your coin searches. Who knows? you might just stumble upon a valuable piece of numismatic history. We're diving into the seemingly unassuming 1980 Washington Quarter, and you won't believe the untold wealth that might be hiding in your pocket change. Before you dismiss the 1980 Washington Quarter as just another coin from the 80s, let's explore why this particular coin is causing a stir among collectors. It turns out, some quarters from this year have a surprising value that could make you rethink their place in your collection. The key to unlocking the hidden value of the 1980 Washington Quarter lies in understanding the varieties and errors associated with this coin. Whether it's a minting anomaly, die variety, or other unique characteristics, certain quarters from 1980 stand out from the rest and can command significant attention from collectors. To appreciate the significance of these quarters, let's take a moment to revisit 1980, a time when these coins were minted. Little did we know that some of these quarters would become sought-after treasures in the world of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. Like any collectible, the condition of the 1980 Washington Quarter is a crucial factor in determining its value. Coins in pristine condition or mint state are naturally more desirable. Rarity, driven by factors such as low mintages or unique errors, plays a significant role and when combined with growing demand among collectors, the potential value becomes even more enticing. Let's take a look at some recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 Washington Quarter. The surprising figures might just make you take a second look at the quarters jingling in your pocket. To gain a deeper understanding, we've consulted with numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 Washington Quarter is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the nuances that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January 2024, this coin value in market $56,789. In conclusion, the 1980 Washington Quarter is not just a relic of the past. It's a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're an avid collector or a casual enthusiast, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin hunts. You never know what kind of unexpected wealth might be hiding in your collection. We're shining a spotlight on the unassuming 1980 Jefferson Nickel, and you won't believe the unexpected wealth that might be concealed in your pocket change. 
Before you dismiss the 1980 Jefferson nickel as just another coin from the 80s, stay tuned to discover why this particular nickel is causing a buzz among collectors. Some of these nickels from 1980 are holding a surprising value that could turn your loose change into a numismatic gold mine. To unlock the hidden value of the 1980 Jefferson nickel, we need to explore the varieties and errors associated with this coin. Whether it's a minting anomaly, die variety, or other unique characteristics, certain nickels from 1980 stand out and can command significant attention from collectors. Let's take a moment to step back into 1980, the year these nickels were minted. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would become sought-after treasures in the world of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 Jefferson nickel is crucial in determining its value. Nickels in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, driven by factors such as low mintages or unique errors, plays a significant role, and when combined with growing demand among collectors, the potential value becomes even more enticing. Let's take a look at some recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 Jefferson nickel. The surprising figures might make you rethink the significance of the nickels in your pocket. For a deeper understanding, we've consulted with numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 Jefferson nickel is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January, this coin value in market $69,780. In conclusion, the 1980 Jefferson nickel is not just a relic of the past, it's a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're an avid collector or a casual enthusiast, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin hunts. You never know what kind of unexpected wealth might be hiding in your collection. We're diving into the world of pocket change with a focus on the often overlooked 1980 D. Roosevelt dime. Brace yourselves, as we uncover the unexpected wealth that might be lingering right in your coin jar. Before you dismiss the 1980 D. Roosevelt dime as just another coin from the 80s, stick around to explore why this particular dime is creating a buzz among collectors. Some of these dimes minted in Denver in 1980 could be hiding a surprising value that might elevate your loose change to a whole new level. To grasp the hidden value of the 1980 D. Roosevelt dime, we need to delve into the varieties and errors associated with this coin. From minting anomalies to unique characteristics, certain dimes from 1980 stand out and can capture the attention of avid collectors. Let's take a moment to transport ourselves back to 1980 the year these dimes were minted. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would become sought-after treasures in the realm of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 D. Roosevelt dime is paramount in determining its value. Dimes in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, influenced by factors like low mintages or unique errors, plays a pivotal role. Combine these with a the growing demand among collectors, and you've got the ingredients for a potentially valuable dime. Let's take a look at recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 D. Roosevelt dime. The surprising figures might just make you reevaluate the significance of the dimes rattling in your pocket. In January 2024, this coin value in market $53,789. For a deeper understanding, we've reached out to numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 D. Roosevelt dime is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these dimes stand out in the world of collecting. The 1980 D. Roosevelt dime is not just loose change, it could be a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're an experienced collector or just starting out, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin searches. You might be holding unexpected wealth in the palm of your hand. We embark on a journey through time to explore the often overlooked 1980 half-dollar coin, and you won't believe the hidden wealth that might be sitting right in your coin collection. Before you dismiss the 1980 half-dollar as just another coin from the 80s, Join us as we uncover why this particular piece is causing a stir among collectors. 
Some of these half dollars from 1980 are rumored to possess a surprising value that could turn your numismatic journey into a profitable adventure. To unveil the concealed value of the 1980 half dollar coin, we must delve into the varieties and errors associated with this coin. From minting anomalies to unique characteristics, certain half dollars from 1980 stand out and can become sought after treasures for avid collectors. Let's take a moment to transport ourselves back to 1980, the year these half dollars were minted. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would evolve into coveted treasures in the realm of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 half dollar is crucial in determining its value. Coins in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, influenced by factors like low mintages or unique errors, plays a pivotal role. Combine these with a growing demand among collectors, and you've got the recipe for a potentially valuable half dollar. Let's take a look at recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 half dollar coin. The surprising figures might make you reconsider the significance of the half dollars tucked away in your coin collection. For a deeper understanding, we've consulted with numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 half dollar coin is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January 2020, for this coin value in market dollar 56970. The 1980 half dollar is not just a relic of the past, it could be a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin searches. You might be holding unexpected wealth in the palm of your hand. We're setting our sights on the 1980 Australian 20 cent coin, and you won't believe the potential wealth that could be stashed in your collection. Stick around as we dive deep into the story of this seemingly ordinary coin. Before you pass off the 1980 Australian 20 cent coin as just another coin from down under, join us on this journey to discover why this particular piece is sparking curiosity among collectors. It turns out that some of these coins minted in 80 are rumored to hold a surprising value, making them true hidden treasures. To unlock the concealed value of the 1980 Australian 20 cent coin, we need to explore the varieties and errors associated with this coin. From minting anomalies to unique characteristics, certain 20 cent coins from 1980 stand out and can become sought after gems for avid collectors. Let's step back into 1980, the year these 20 cent coins were minted in Australia. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would evolve into prized possessions in the realm of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems from down under. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 Australian 20 cent coin is crucial in determining its value. Coins in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, influenced by factors like low mintages or unique errors, plays a pivotal role. Combine these with a growing demand among collectors and you've got the recipe for a potentially valuable 20-cent coin. Let's take a look at recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 Australian 20-cent coin. The surprising figures might make you reassess the significance of these coins in your collection and inspire you to take a closer look. For a deeper understanding, we've reached out to numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 Australian 20-cent coin is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January 2020, for this coin value in market $78,900. The 1980 Australian 20 cent coin is not just loose change, it could be a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin searches. You might be holding unexpected wealth from down under. We have an exciting topic that might just make you rethink the coins in your collection, the 1980 Australian one-cent coin. Stick around as we unveil the hidden value that could turn this seemingly ordinary coin into a valuable treasure. Before you dismiss the 1980 Australian one-cent coin as mere pocket change, join us on this exploration to discover why certain pieces from this year are causing a stir among collectors. 
It's time to shine a spotlight on these coins and reveal the potential wealth they might be hiding. To unlock the concealed value of the 1980 Australian one-cent coin, let's explore the varieties and errors associated with this coin. From minting anomalies to unique characteristics, certain one-cent coins from 1980 stand out and can become highly sought after by avid collectors. Let's take a trip back to 1980, the year these one-cent coins were minted in Australia. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would evolve into prized possessions in the realm of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 Australian one-cent coin is crucial in determining its value. Coins in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, influenced by factors like low mintages or unique errors, plays a pivotal role. Combine these with a growing demand among collectors, and you've got the ingredients for a potentially valuable one-cent coin. Let's take a look at recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 Australian one-cent coin. The surprising figures might make you reevaluate the significance of these coins in your collection and inspire you to take a closer look. For a deeper understanding, we've reached out to numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 Australian one cent coin is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January 2020, for this coin value in market $66,780. In conclusion, the 1980 Australian one-cent coin is not just loose change, it could be a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin searches. You might be holding unexpected wealth in the palm of your hand. We're diving into the intriguing world of Australian coins, focusing on the 1980 Australian five-cent coin. Get ready to be amazed as we uncover the hidden wealth that might be waiting in your collection. Before you consider the 1980 Australian 5-cent coin just another piece of change, join us on this coin safari to discover why certain coins from this year are causing a stir among collectors. It's time to shine a spotlight on these coins and reveal the surprising value they might be holding. To unravel the concealed value of the 1980 Australian 5-cent coin, Let's explore the varieties and errors associated with this coin. From minting anomalies to unique characteristics, certain 5-cent coins from 1980 stand out and can become highly sought after by avid collectors. Let's step back into 1980, the year these 5-cent coins were minted in Australia. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would evolve into prized possessions in the world of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 Australian five-cent coin is pivotal in determining its value. Coins in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, influenced by factors like low mintages or unique errors, plays a significant role. Combine these with a growing demand among collectors and you've got the elements for a potentially valuable five-cent coin. Let's take a look at recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 Australian five-cent coin. The surprising figures might make you reassess the significance of these coins in your collection and inspire you to take a closer look. For a deeper understanding, we've reached out to numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 Australian five-cent coin is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January 2020, for this coin value in market $66,890. The 1980 Australian 5 cent coin is not just a common coin, it could be a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin searches. You might be holding unexpected wealth in the palm of your hand. We're crossing borders to explore the 1980 Canadian 25-cent coin. Get ready to be amazed as we uncover the hidden riches that might be lingering right in your collection. Before you consider the 1980 Canadian 25-cent coin just another part of your loose change, join us on this coin quest to discover why certain coins from this year are causing a stir among collectors. 
It's time to put the spotlight on these coins and unveil the surprising value they might be holding. To unlock the concealed value of the 1980 Canadian 25 cent coin, let's explore the varieties and errors associated with this coin. From minting anomalies to unique characteristics, certain 25 cent coins from 1980 stand out and can become highly sought after by avid collectors. Let's step back into 1980, the year these 25 cent coins were minted in Canada. Little did we know that some of these seemingly ordinary coins would evolve into prized possessions in the world of numismatics. Understanding the historical context adds an extra layer of fascination to these hidden gems. As with any collectible, the condition of the 1980 Canadian 25 cent coin is pivotal in determining its value. Coins in mint state or pristine condition are naturally more desirable. Rarity, influenced by factors like low mintages or unique errors, plays a significant role. Combine these with a the growing demand among collectors, and you've got the elements for a potentially valuable 25 cent coin. Let's take a look at recent sales or auction results involving the 1980 Canadian 25 cent coin. The surprising figures might make you reassess the significance of these coins in your collection and inspire you to take a closer look. For a deeper understanding, We've reached out to numismatic experts who share their insights into why the 1980 Canadian 25 cent coin is gaining attention. Their expertise sheds light on the unique aspects that make these coins stand out in the world of collecting. In January 2020, for this coin value in market $66,780. The 1980 Canadian 25 cent coin is not just part of the Great White Norse currency. It could be a potential treasure waiting to be discovered. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, keep an eye out for these hidden gems during your coin searches. You might be holding unexpected wealth in your collection. If you enjoyed this exploration into the world of coins, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to BBC Earth Coins for more coin discoveries, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on our numismatic adventures. Until next time, happy hunting!